Hey, I'm sure it sounds familiar, but all your problems could so easily be solved if you follow these easy steps. Hello guys and welcome to today's 800k squad builder. Now today we have a squad, bi squad builder that is OP and has some ridiculously good and cheap players. So let's get into this. Guys, before we get into this, I just want to say this squad does fit into the 4-3-1-2, second variation or the 4-3-3 third variation with the two centre mids and the CDM. So yeah, let's get back into this. So in goal, we start off in Argentina and we do have Armani. This guy's 90 rated, 6 foot 2, great height. 89 diving has some ridiculously good stats. And with a basic chemistry style, he would have 99 diving, 99 reflexes, 96 handling, 50, uh, 57 speed, 90 kicking and 99 positioning. And he does have the trait comes for crosses, which is obviously great for not conceding any corners or anything like that. It does only cost 40k, which is a great price and I highly suggest using this guy. At uh, right back, we do have Bustos. Now, although this guy is high low work rates, you do get this guy from the Libertadoras uh, League SBC, which is really cheap and does only cost 53k. It might be, uh, yeah, I don't know which one. It's either Libertadoras or the, I can't remember the other one, but it's one of the two uh copa uh, league sbcs or it comes up in the league sbc section uh high low work rates obviously isn't the best uh but with stay back while attacking he will be back most of the time five foot six obviously makes him more fast or makes him faster sorry uh gives him 95 pace 76 shooting with the 90 attack position uh, 90 attack positioning and 88 shot power as 85 passing with 92 crossing 89 short pass um ridiculous dribbling uh op in some defensive areas like stand tackle slide tackle but has average uh, awareness and interceptions and his physical is yeah again okay like aggression and stamina and average strength but does have quite low jumping for a five foot six player his early crosser which compared which uh, with his 92 crossing will make him ridiculous and yeah 50k for that guy at right center back we do have lopez now this guy's from the opposite sbc to bustos and does only cost uh, 63k and i know i'm saying only but it's six foot three with the stats of <laughs> i don't know uh, a better version of Van Dyke, I might say. Uh, six at three, medium high work rates, which are ridiculous. 81 pace, which, which is actually really good. 96 reactions, ridiculous passing and composure. Uh, the defending is just out of this world, and the physical is like Godin. He has like he's complete on physical, it's just the stamina that brings him down. I do suggest using an anchor on this guy and a anchor on Busto just to rise the pace a little bit because you can never have enough pace so yeah definitely use an anchor on this guy uh, or no definitely a shadow actually because he already is complete on physical so yeah definitely use a shadow on this guy and let's move on to the next centre back so at left centre back we do have Otamendi Scream is that his Scream? no that's Team of the Week we do have Otamendi Scream which is this one uh, he has 80 pace, 85 defending and 80 physical. Uh, 80 pace, actually quite average. I mean, good, but still. Uh, 92 reactions, 93 composure. Okay defending, good in some areas, average in others. And the physical, like, um, like Lopez, is almost complete, apart from the strength. I definitely suggest using an anchor, just as I said, to get the pace, defending and physical up. He does have the trait solid player as well, which is a great one to have on a centre back. A six foot, which you might think is quite low, but medium high work rates and the 90 or jumping will make him so much better. And yeah, definitely use an anchor on him. He's only 80k as well, and I do think that is actually a reasonable price considering he is from the Prem and is does actually have pretty good stats. At left back, we do go to the Prem. And we do have 80, is it 80, uh, 6 in form Robertson. Now this guy's 60k, uh, but he does get some ridiculous uh, links. It does have some ridiculous stats. Like he has the 86 pace, which is actually quite average. 91 crossing, uh, okay dribbling, uh, reactions and ball control are actually pretty good. But quite average in the agility, balance, dribbling. And actually not that bad composure. His defending is actually pretty good. It's just the heading accuracy that brings it down. And the physical... 
Uh, for being 5 foot 10, he does only have 62 jumping and 65 strength, but does have 95 stamina. With the 91 crossing, early crosser will actually be a great trait to have. And he is high high, which I do love in a full back, just means he gets uh, up and down the pitch. Uh, perfect. And with a stay back while attacking, he would be probably, that will probably be the best, like, uh, work rates to uh, tactics combination you can probably get on a full back. 5 foot 10 with 60 jumping obviously isn't the best, but left foot for a left back. And only 60k, uh, so yeah. At right wing, we do go to uh, uh, Ligue 1, and we do go to right wing, and we have, is it, oh no, he's a right to mid, actually. And we do have 88 in form Di Maria. Now, we will be playing this guy at Cam in game, and although he does have two star weak foot, he has some ridiculous stats. Uh, 5 foot 11, high medium work rates, 5 star skills, 87 pace, 84 shooting, 86 passing, and 90 dribbling with 97 agility. Okay balance, but the rest of his stats are just ridiculous. Uh, it does actually, I mean, obviously, does you don't expect him to have seven, uh, good physical with being 5'11", but does a flare outside foot shot, and yeah, just some crazy passing, shooting, uh, pace and dribbling stats, and only costing 64k, and yeah, I definitely suggest using a hunter on this guy, because he already has amazing uh, dribbling and passing, uh, so yeah, definitely use a hunter on this guy, and yeah, only 60k. At left wing, or um, left striker in game, we do have uh, inform. Oh no, sorry, we do have normal uh, Sadio Mane. Uh, Ninety-four pace, really good shooting, just bad in long shots, volleys, and penalties. His passing, I mean, you're playing him up front, so it doesn't really matter. He does have insane dribbling and actually. Uh, Surprisingly pretty good physical when it comes to the jumping and stamina and actually quite average aggression. He has flair which is a great trait but most attackers have it. 4 star, 4 star, 5 foot 9 and hit high medium work rates. I definitely suggest using a sniper on this guy just to get the agility and balance up a little bit more. But if you already like the dribbling, go for a, a hunter or an, a hawk just to get the strength, jumping and aggression up a bit more. But yeah. Only f uh, 37k, and I think this card is definitely worth the coins that you're paying. And yeah, it just has some godly stats. So, at uh, right striker in game, we do have the man himself, a normal gold, Killian Mbappe. Now, I did use this guy in draft the other day, and I thought he was godly. Uh, being 5 star skills, 4 star weak foot, high low work rates, 5 foot 10, uh, having 96 pace with 92 agility and, nine, and 83 balance, having those like dribbling and ball control stats and having the 89 attack positioning, 89 finishing and 83 shot power. He yeah, does have the trait finesse shot which combined with only 79 curve, I mean... I, I don't a bit, I think that's a bit controversial, but still flair, which as I said, most most forwards do have an outside foot shot. So yeah, I do definitely suggest using a maybe a dead eye just to get the curve up a bit uh, on for the finesse shot trait. But yeah, I mean I say only for his price, but he is only two hundred and fifteen k, which for this caliber of card is just really cheap considering he was like at least 500k a couple of weeks ago so yeah he's our right striker our central cdm um sorry our cdm in uh this team is i'll just go to him is kante now this guy i mean i've used him in some of my SBCs, I mean, just as a goodly card, being 5 foot 6, medium high work rate, 78 pace, 81 dribbling, having 82 agility and 92 balance, having 87 defending, which is the calibre of an icon, because it's just the he uh, heading accuracy that brings him down, and has 97 stamina, which is the best stamina on the game, and 90 aggression, which obviously pushed him to win the ball back quite a lot more, and being 46k... Uh, I, yeah, I definitely suggest using a shadow on this card, just get the 78 pace up a bit. And yeah, solid player as well, which is a great trait to have on a CDM. And yeah, <clears throat> I definitely suggest using this guy. At uh, left centre mid in-game, we do have 
special Chelsea. We do have Team of the Season Kovacic. Now this guy has a great card, especially for left centre mid, being for high high work rates. 5 foot 9, 4 star, 4 star, 86 pace, 91 passing, 95 dribbling with the 98 ball control and the agility balance and the rest of it. 87 defending but only 81 slide tackle which I do find a bit funny and 93 stamina with 92 aggression. This guy has really similar stats to Kante but obviously better um, and I definitely suggest, I don't know, something to do with shooting I'd give him a finisher just to get the uh, physical up a bit more. Uh, but yeah, for 100k, I think it's godly card considering if this was an icon. It's basically Hullet. It's better than Hullet. I mean, obviously he's not Hullet gang considering he only has 79 shooting. But he is better than probably mid-icon Hullet. So yeah, for only 100k, um, you have to get this guy. And up front, I'll give you an option of who you can use. So... I, I am using, for this, I am using uh, Pogba. Now, instead of Pogba, obviously, you can use 86 or 84 Ducore, but I'd rather have Pogba. I mean, 4-star, 5-star with 5-star skills, 4-star weak foot, 6-foot-3, which is taller than Ducore, high-medium work rates, 74 pace, 81 shooting, 86 passing, 85 dribbling, and 86 physical. Uh, only 66 balance and 75 agility, but he's not going to be running everywhere. And I do definitely suggest using a hunter or an engine. A hunter just to get the finishing and attack positioning up. Um, no, actually, sorry, I definitely suggest using a shadow just to get the defending up. Uh, because he is, we are going to be playing him as a, a wide centre mid. So you definitely want the defending to go up. Uh, so yeah, I definitely suggest using a shadow because if we are playing him as a wide centre mid, you definitely want the pace to go up and especially the defending. And yeah, he's only 43k as well. But yeah, if you do want a more all-round card, definitely do go for Informed Decore. But yeah, I'm, I'm using um, Paul Pogba. Um, in game guys we are uh, we are switching to the obviously you can play the 4-3-1-2 but I'm playing the 4-1-2-1-2 second variation I'm playing Mane at striker with Mbappe uh, playing Kovacic at uh, right centre mid and Di Maria at Cam with Pogba. It doesn't matter because they both have four star weak foot, but you can play Pogba on the left and Kovacic on the right. With Kante at CDM, obviously the centre backs and Bustos and Robertson, obviously left back and right back. Uh, I'd give, I'd play Bustos and Robertson stay back while attacking and either overlap or uh, inverted run or you can just have him on balance but I'd have him on inverted or overlap uh, I'd have Kante on stay back while attacking cover center and cut passing lanes and I would have Pogba and Kovacic on stay back while um, on balanced cover center and man mark and I'd have Di Maria on stay forward um, and stay on edge of box for cross and Mane and Mbappe on stay central get in behind and stay forward. So this is today's 800k squad builder guys. Uh, it's absolute god squad. And yeah I definitely suggest it if you can afford it. Please subscribe, like, turn post notifications on. Um, and follow my Instagram. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. I post like uh, in-game summaries of uh, team of the seasons. And like new SVCs that have come out. So yeah, one more time, please subscribe, like, turn post notifications on and follow my Instagram in the description below. Thank you for watching and peace.